Hi, I'm Ina Fitzgibbon. I direct the rehab services over at Palm Drive Hospital. It's a small hospital in Sebastopol, California. And we do inpatient rehab services and outpatient rehab services, and that includes physical therapy, occupational therapy, hand therapy, and speech therapy. So physical therapy or therapy in general is the art and science of rehab. So normally when someone gets injured, you know, we see them so that they, we get them back to their regular function. So for instance, if you had a soccer player who tore the meniscus or tore a ligament, then sometimes they have to go through surgery or not, but we go through the rehab and it's a couple months to get them back to where they were functioning before. So we have a, the basic equipment here. This is a Pilates reformer here, um, parallel bars. And these are one of the treatment rooms. So we have John, he's just measuring, again, the range of motion. The motion. Okay, I'll show you the hand therapy area. So hand therapy, you know, that's actually a very, very unique uh, thing that we have here in the clinic. There are only 5,000 hand therapists nationwide. So Cynthia is our primary hand therapist and she was really responsible for building up the hand therapy practice. We basically try to get people back to uh, what they were doing before they injured their hand. So this is Dan and he injured a uh, tendon in here. Makes his wrist go like that, flex carpi ulnaris. He's doing really well today, it's his second visit. He uh, got into the Fluido machine, which is a, a whirlpool, a dry whirlpool, and he doubled his range of motion. So he's real happy about that. Did that help with your pain? Uh, actually, yeah, I did. Okay, so then this this part here where you have your scar mm -hmm. tends to be really sensitive. Yeah. And uh, is it less sensitive now? Yeah, yeah, actually, definitely. We see people of all injuries and also people of all ages. So it could be from a toddler all the way to like 104 years old. So Jim's one of our therapists. And Jim, you want to talk about what you specialize in? Uh, outpatient musculoskeletal orthopedics, uh, post-surgical stuff, and preventative care for injury prevention and functional management. Yeah. Jim has been very involved in the new place, just as the whole staff. But it's been great uh, working with Jim as far as programs that we have for the new place. So as far as the wellness programs, exercise programs, we've been working on that. So, yeah. What do you like about physical therapy? Helping people, uh, empowering people to manage the, their own body's problems. Uh, and not only in a rehab state, but in an injury prevention state. Uh, to make a move better. Yeah. <laughs> And I know. And there's Pat. Pat is our hand therapist, and I just described how it is to be hand therapist. Right. And can you talk a little bit more about what you love about hand therapy? Oh, what's great about hand therapy is you know if someone comes in with an injury or a limitation, and you guide them through, and they're so, so appreciative when they they see success at the end, they can use their extremity well again and get back to a functional level. And they're just so excited, and you're excited for them. How long have you been a hand therapist? Um, 22 years. 22 years. <laughs> and that's a hand therapist. But, you know, occupational therapist would be. They're longer. Yeah, yeah. But I'm not even going to ask anybody. Yeah. <laughs> so, right now we're just a little bit cramped, so we're actually moving to a bigger location. And so this is the site of our new facility. We actually have a new name as well, because previously our name was just rehab services, kind of like a department. But we decided, you know, because we are serving the community of West County, West County Hand and Physical Therapy. The reason for hand there is because, you know, we've had a hand therapist for a long time, but it doesn't seem like people really know about it. So we decided to have the word hand in there. So this is about 5,300 square feet, I think. Yeah, 5,300. Whereas the other place was about 3,187. And we worked with architects to try to figure out if there's any any other way we could uh, expand the building, but we really have outgrown our current place. And so this, you know, came as an opportunity and uh, this was previously the bowling alley. I don't know if you guys have heard that, but you know, everyone tells me, hey, that was a bowling alley. So this is the exercise studio. And we decided to have an exercise studio because we do a lot of classes. Again, we do the fall classes, 
balance prevention classes and we always have to use the conference room of the hospital which sometimes is not available but this time we could actually hold classes you know whether it's a back strengthening class a back school class um, we could just have it here and at the same time with our current patients they could see that and they know their options as far as transitioning I think the thing we have to understand about therapy is we treat all sorts of things whether it's brain injury stroke sports rehab, or even um, a work injury. Like let's just say for someone who's in front of the computer typing a lot, most of the time they end up with repetitive injury, but we, we do that as well. And I think the move has been to um, towards injury prevention. So catching the injury before it even happens. So we're looking forward to moving to the new facility and hopefully that happens around mid-September. And we are excited to offer the new programs for the community and not necessarily physical therapy, occupational therapy and hand therapy based but also community, community programs that would give um, the members access to a life of wellness. So for more information please go to our website www.palmdrivehospital.org and click on West County Hand and Physical Therapy and our telephone number is going to be the same 824 8018 and that's West County Hand and Physical Therapy. Thanks.